All right, so yesterday's video is uploading right now. Uh, it's night, as you can see out there. I'm getting a really late start to the day for the uh, day two of Celebi quests and stuff. And so I'm still on stage two rippling time, obviously, because I'm on the catch uh, Pokemon three days in a row. I'm on day two, but I'm um, hoping for the bug where I can get uh, the next day, maybe sometime around now, because it's 8.30, and 8.30 is when I got it yesterday. So maybe we'll be able to advance soon. Got to evolve a grass type, make three new friends, Hopefully when the video goes up, I'll get some friend requests from that since I put my friend code in there a couple times. But yeah, I really need to get to that next stage soon because uh, I put uh, nine eggs in incubators in preparation for what tier three is. So if I don't get to tier three before those hatch, then I'm in trouble. But yeah, actually before I leave, I just have to add like title, description, stuff like that. But uh, meeting up with some friends in a bit and we're gonna go out shiny hunting again. Hopefully I can have some luck tonight, get one of those new shinies. Oh boy, now it's my turn. Good luck, Nick. Mm, no. This is the one sunken. Got oh, I just got it right. as I was yeah, like on the right, yeah, I got it. getting the other quest. Mm, yeah, yeah. There. Yeah. One more. Oh. oh. Three, three, two, one, go. Oh. No. Oh. No. Three, two, one, go. Come on, come on, come on! Come on! Come on, come on! Oh. 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 Yeah. What a trash run, man! Is it hello? Okay, the microphone's on. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be it's gonna be really loud when I it's a good action shot. Stick my head out. Oh there's moonlight! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I forgot, what am I doing? <laughs> okay, I can finally complete tier three. <laughs> I think I'm behind. Thanks to Herky USA for adding me from today's video. It's my third friend, and I need a grass type Pokemon to evolve. So everything here is an eligible grass type to evolve for the tier, th wait, what is this? Tier three, tier two? What am I on? <laughs> no, I'm on tier two. Should I on tier two? You're still on two? <laughs> All of these are eligible. Ivysaur, Gloom, Weeping Bell, Bayleaf, uh, Skip Bloom, Lombre, is that called Nuzleaf? And Grovile, but I don't have a Grovile. So I think Hopip's the easiest one just because Hopip's are everywhere. And I want to save the sun. Oh, can't see. Can't see anything. <laughs> it's so dark. <laughs> can't see, uh, I mean, what was I? <laughs> I'm losing my train of thought. Should I use my flashlight? <laughs> <laughs> hey! There's lights on the building! Okay, there! Tier 2! 1500. Should I put it? Oh, not two! Not shiny. Uh, okay. Sunstone! Put that to good use. Excellent work! I feel we're getting closer to this mythical Pokemon. I wonder if we can find some more friends for it by hatching some eggs. How would, how, what? Maybe you could put that sunstone you've earned to good use as well. Please reach level 25. Heh. <laughs> use a sunstone to evolve Gloomer Sun Current and hatch Maybe? nine eggs. Okay. Level 25 is done, obviously. Hatch nine eggs, coming right up. Sunstone to evolve Gloomer Sun Current. I can't afford the Sun Current, but I don't want to waste the sunstone on Gloom. 2.2K left until nine eggs hatch. And sunstones, I have eight. Oh, flashlight. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lunatone. <laughs> okay, so I did use the sunstone to evolve a sun current, and then I got the quests, the pine code quests. No, my stack is like 50 pine codes at this point. Do you have more? Eh, no. Eh, nope. Alright, 
2.1k to go on the eggs. All right, so the car grinding is done. Now I'm just doing a bit of walking, but I got the eggs to like, oh, okay, I got the eggs to hatch. This might be just one though. I think this is the one in the infinite incubator and the supers are gonna be really close. Got the star piece on, but I think the lucky again did. Chimecho, Chimeco, Chimeco. Yeah, the others are 6.62. <laughs> now we got a Mareep and wait, uh, let me quickly, oh wait, that was a spoiler. I already know everything that's hatching now. What could this be? A Snorlax. Another Mareep. A Phoebus. Trappage. But this is 578. Whoa, how did I know? Oh, wait a minute. This is like a 98% trap inch. Simply amazing attack defense. I think it's exactly the same as one I already have. All right, so back home again, and I did something not so great. So after I went through all those 10Ks, and I hatched them all for the uh, for the Celebi quest, uh, well, it's 12.05 right now, I rushed to open a bunch of gifts before midnight so I could hit my daily limit uh, to level up as many friends as possible and I forgot that I had just completely cleared out my egg inventory, so I have nine Alolan eggs from Montreal. Hmm. I didn't really want Alolan eggs. All right, well, here we go then, I guess. Claim the reward. A King's Rock premium raid pass and an, a Pokemon encounter. Ooh, wait a minute. Oh wait, why am I using my pineapps on this? I need to save them for sun currents and natus. So, perfect Eevee is 415 from a quest. So this is 411, so this is probably really good. First ball, pineapped it. First catch of the day after midnight. And simply amazing HP defense. So this is most likely a 98% Eevee with 14 attack. All right, Professor Willow. Oh wow, is that an Eevee you've caught? Perfect timing. Ah, oh, look, at perfect timing. What a guy. <laughs> Did you know that this Pokemon's unstable genetic makeup enables it to take on one of several different evolutions or evolutions? I'll bet if you spend some time with it during the day, you'll be able to evolve your Eevee into an Espeon, a psychic type Pokemon, just like the mythical Pokemon I'm researching. Can you walk 10 kilometers with your Eevee as your buddy to earn candy, evolve Eevee into Espeon during the day, and send 20 gifts to friends? So, like I said, it's midnight right now, so obviously we're not doing the Espeon evolution. Send gifts to friends. I literally just went through all my gifts. <laughs> so, should have known that because the people in the car with me tonight were on this step. So I should have saved my gifts. Walk 10 kilometers with an Eevee as your buddy to earn candy. So that's somewhat disappointing because this Eevee I have is already walked 10K for Espeon and this other one that's supposed to be coming Umbreon is already 10K. So I have the distance already, I, but I still need to walk them again. So just in case you guys don't mind some spoilers, don't look over here for the next quest coming up uh, for the Celebi research. Uh, I'll put a timestamp here if you want to skip ahead so you don't hear the spoilers for the quest. But if you're like me and you want to prepare, then, well step four is right here, we know what that is. Step five, step five is almost the exact same thing. It's walk 10 kilometers with an Eevee as your buddy to get candy, evolve into an Umbreon at night, and trade a Pokemon instead of send 20 gifts. Then the next step, step six out of eight, visit Pokestops seven days in a row. Seven days in a row. Why? Then use 25 pineapple berries while catching Pokemon, that's easy peasy. And use items to evolve Pokemon two times, also easy. Visit Pokestop seven days in a row means somehow I managed to walk 20K for Eevees in the next day. I evolve Espeon tomorrow during the day, then Umbreon at night. That means the soonest I can get through this quest is still next Tuesday. And I was taking a trip this weekend and I was like, I could grind it out and then I'll sit on the Celebi a couple days and not catch it so I can catch it somewhere cool. Now I'm not even gonna be like halfway done by the time the freaking trip comes around. Why? That, like people are just, everybody's gonna get to this point and just sit here for days. Anyways, that's, I don't have anything left to say. I don't, th this wasn't a good idea on their part, I think. But anyways, I think that's gonna be it for this video. Uh, I know that was like sort of a quick one. I mean, we spent most time here talking about this stuff. But uh, the actual stuff out there was really quick. Uh, we were just driving around, grinding. I just filmed the parts where I actually did Celebi quests, and most of the other time was shiny checking. Uh, we got one shiny pine co in the car. Actually, one shiny pine co in the car earlier, and then one afterwards after we all left. But none of them were mine yet. Once I get through these 
Two Eevees I gotta walk. Might start walking a Nachu or a Sun Current at this point. All right, well that's gonna be it for this video. If you guys wanna see my next video tomorrow for more Celebi stuff, then be sure to hit the subscribe button. And if you like this button, then hit, if you like this video, then hit the like button. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.